the burden, the burden, the burden, the burden. The meat's are coming, coming. The meat's are coming, coming. Babylon, Babylon, daughter of Babylon. The meat's are coming, coming. Daughter of Babylon, the meat's are coming, coming. The burden, the burden, the burden, the burden of Babylon. The burden of Babylon. Which Isaiah, the son of Amos, did see, lift ye up a banner upon the high mountain, exalt the voice unto the Lord, shake the hands, that they may go into the gates of the nobles. I have commanded my sanctified ones, I have also called on the mighty ones, the mighty anger. Because you notice that the Persian Gulf, uh, it empties out into the uh, Persian Gulf, and we're going to discuss that in a, another video. But the main issue here is that when we read the book of Daniel, Daniel was there, and um, the one like one unlike to the Son of Man appeared before him by the river Hiddekel, or the Tigris River. Now we know that that had to do with um, a future prophetic event that the Most High uh, was showing Daniel. But it has to do with Persia. So we're going to talk about that in a later video. The issue here is that it has to do with Orion and a judgment. Because uh, Yeshaya or Christ told me that uh, Orion is a clock. Now, the Bible states there's nothing new under the sun. And there was something very prophetic that went on before you. Ishaya came down as the savior of Israel in this area. Now, Turkey was once part of Syria there before um, the Ottomans came in and took over that land. The original Greeks uh, were Asian, if you will, or sons of Japhet. And during the time of the Maccabees, it was a uprising against um, Antiochus Epiphanes. We know that according to the book of Maccabees, uh, Alexander the Greek, or they call him Alexander the Great, uh, nevertheless, he was a European. Nevertheless, he was an Edomite. He took over and his general, he, well, he died and his generals took over and after that, many evils began uh, to multiply upon the earth. They divided certain territories to themselves, and there was an uprising of the Jews against uh, Antiochus Epiphanes. He wanted them to, you know, basically put down their heritage and stop serving their power. And um, yeah, basically, he declared himself as God, um, even the title of his name has to do with some type of reference there and so and it has to do with um, hence the name Antiochus Epiphanes oh, this is what it sounds like when the eagles cry come on Jeremiah 49 Edom have us say the Messiah of hosts is whistling no more in demon and the mass is counsel when perish from the prudent is their wisdom vanish and flee ye turn back dwell deep O inhabitants of Dedan for I will bring the calamity of Esau upon him the time that I will visit him if great gatherings come to be this would they not leave some gleaning grapes? If these by night they will destroy till they had enough, 